Good evening ladies and gentlemen, I'm Easy69 and welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be looking at MMW27 driving the M6A2E1 EXP and it's an amazing battle, it's crazy. This tank is almost OP and people don't complain about this tank as much as they complain about tanks like the Objects uh, 252U. This tank's armor frontally is almost impenetrable. It's amazing. It really is very, very strong. It does have some weak spots on the turret, but if you just rock backwards, forward, move your turret side to side, that becomes very, very difficult to penetrate. Uh, but it's not impenetrable. I mean, if you're staying still and people can fully aim in at your weak spots, you can be penned with, with AP. But this battle on Himmelsdorf, he's going to have an amazing battle. Now, already he has bounced uh, 560 damage. He's had a few shots that hasn't penned. I mean, that shot there, I think that was from the J Panther, a tier 7, and that could penetrate the, the turret when fully aimed in, fully aimed in and it goes the rng goes on your side so now there is a tank down there is the bulldog that is down uh, but he's holding this very very well he's he's mm, good good hit point trading i mean he's only been shot once and he's now on 1100 damage now the is6 has decided to push forward but he's not going to be baited he's not going to go out and try and get those shots on the is6 he's just going to wait because there's three or four other tanks that is at the back of the map so if he starts going out now to get shots on the is6 uh, he's going to get absolutely wrecked now that's two tanks down but he has bring the tiger p and the is3 defender to a one shot and the j panther is also a one shot so nice shot there a bit of a low roll unfortunately leaves him on just 20 hp so he's just going to wait i would definitely load up the he now just to guarantee the pen because the the tiger p's armor is very very troll uh, so now he's on 2300 damage again another blocked 1100 block damage he has got the he loaded and he does clear him so mmw that is the, his first kill now he has protection well he did have protection from the uh tiger p but he didn't last very long so now he's got a shot on the is6 uh, turret now the best thing about this tank is obviously the armor is insane but because it is so big the tank is so big you can come over these ridge lines very very easily and i mean just look how easy he, it is for him to get the shots off on the is6 turret i mean the is6 is not the best armored tank in the game but if the is6 decided to try and go hold down because his tank is so tall he can easily just shoot the top of his turret and there's some certain maps i mean mines the middle of mines you can just roll up to the middle and just poke your turret over the edge and get some shots but now it is a two versus four it was a two versus five and luckily unfortunately doesn't get that shot on the j panther and that is going to be heartbreaking because now he's on three kills and it's one against three and the last three tanks are pretty stupid if 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 you ask me they're pretty stupid they're all medium tanks or light tanks but yet they are trying to play the long distance game uh long distance against an exp is definitely not going to work in their favors and you can just see he is bouncing everything that comes his way however the amx has decided to try and flank around but mm has spotted that and he's decided to come around this corner now he does have a decision to make does he sit and wait or does he go and try and chase that amx and he could get some side shots from the other two tanks uh he did go but he decides to change his mind and he's going to go for the comet he had a high he has a high roll loaded and he does finish off the comet bringing it down now to a one versus two so 4800 damage 3600 and 75 block damage and it's now just a one versus two however it is a panther panther he's going to get one shot again he gets the bounce and it is an amx he does still need to be careful because the amx is an auto loader so if he gets um stuck and loses his nerve nerve the amx can 
count on that and just get behind him. Now, at the moment, he's just... He bounces every shot that comes his way, but the moment he wants to bounce, he's not bouncing anything. He does manage to take out the Panther, now leaving just the AMX, and he needs to face this guy. He needs a bounce. He definitely needs a bounce or a low roll like that, leaving him on 10 HP. Very, very well played. Almost 4,000 block damage, and he gets 6,155. Six kills, still wall, Kolobanov, uh, he gets the lot. Very, very well played, MMW. Hope you enjoyed that, guys. I'm Meezy69, and I'll catch you soon. Bye-bye.